Oh, there. Winkershire. We actually do have a dog called Winkershire. That's the weirdest thing in the world. What the hell is a Winkershire? Winkershire. Winkershire? That's a weird name. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to episode four. Four? Yeah, four. Of my Rise to Ruin uh, playthrough. Um, the last episode, we built a wall, or tried to build a wall at least, um, and this time we are going to continue building the wall. Now, I do apologize if my frame rate is a little bit choppy. Um, yes, I need some defenses very quickly, but anyway, I was saying, um, I do apologize if my frame rate is a bit choppy. It's not being very nice at the moment, and just going a little bit crazy, so hopefully this will only be this episode that it does that but we'll see um so what have we got uh we've got we should put our defenses up so rangers could essentially defend the city uh defend the town um at night which is what we want so what we're trying to do is going to build a wall across here build a gate here and build some defenses that's pretty much the main priority right now and kind of build the defenses up here we're just going to block off this area so we're going to force the force the um bad guys to go around the long way but we'll see we'll see how that goes so let's see so what have we got right now there's a little bit of a wait waiting game at the moment we've got a landfill which is filling up reasonably fast we've got a rangers who's going to protect the city we're probably going to have a few monsters attack us but the first few nights you're going to be alright. You're not going to have too much strife. But it's probably the second night you're going to have the most strife. So The problem that I had is I'm, I've made the city, uh, the, the town a lot, very far away from where I want the borders. So that's probably going to cause a lot of problems. Ooh, so we've got this, we've got this up here now. So let's, let's finish up the wall up here. So we can complete that wall. We're gonna build that wall finally. Hashtag I'm not Trump. Don't don't even compare me to that guy. Alright. So I'm gonna make sure burner there. It's, that shouldn't be the priority. The, the priority needs to be the wall. So let's shove that to the top. Now we'll probably want to get more housing. So this is called probably be priority two. Actually, no, that's gonna be priority one. And that's no that's gonna be priority one that's gonna be priority two the walls are gonna be priority three and that's gonna be priority four because if you have spare room that encourages nomads which is what we want we want nomads to come that is the goal that's the dream nomads have to come all right i've only got 12 people Monsters are seeming to leave us alone. We're not having too much. Okay, now we're probably going to have a lot of drama. And I'll probably, probably put a holy go golem. So he, that's kind of like a defense unit um, that you can use with some of the magic that you gather. So hopefully he's going to hold off. It's a bit of the, bit of the problems we're going to have. Now he's going to the wall. Oh, he's, he's going to build the wall. He's going to the wall. We've got people going to the wall, and he's going to build that. Good. Good. We need our defenses up. This is pretty much this episode is all about that. That's the main focus. That's what we're going to do. Whether we achieve it or not, we're going to find out. But we should get that up at least. So at least we've got that priority done, or that building done. Or he's going to build it too. Virginia Potts or her. Sorry. My mistake. I should not assume. My mistake. We've got the wall. Yep, we've got a bit of the wall at the top. Okay. Because we're going to close that off. Lock that down. Now, how are we with resources? Um... Hmm. 
don't really have anyone who can move around. I mean, we pr we might be able to move a watermaster to a builder. We could do that. How are we looking on food? Food's pretty average. Pretty much got everyone that can build to build. All right, here we go. Here we go. Um, all right, we'll move that across here. There we go. That's what we want. And then we shove that to there. Ooh, we've got a bit of this wall now. Now, if we... Oh, we need that there. We need that finished. How are we going here? Only one bit of the wall. Oh, we've got a builder coming. I think they're going to finish that bit. But... Not a lot of building going on. A lot of walking. Not a lot of building. We need to close off this. Here we go. There we go. That's that's what we want to see. And we've got a bit of trash there. So we're going to help them out and pop that there. Because trash... What I've noticed with trash is that it messes your, your game up very quickly if you're not onto it. So, if you see any trash, let me know. But... Alright, so we've got water filling it up. I'm happy with that. We need... Oh! Ah. Don't, that's, I don't like you. Uh, you can go here. We're going to pop that dude there. That's going to be the... It's going to be the, the monster prison for now. I'm going to shove all the monsters in there and just for them to go insane there. Hopefully they'll leave us alone. Alright, we've got that. Perfect. Boom. Now we probably can dismantle this too. We don't really need that. So we built a, a, a wall along there. And we just need to finish that. And then we're probably going to make the gate there. But we need the wall built first. And we have to watch out for... For monsters. The wall will be built. Unlike Trump, I will build this wall and I will keep monsters out, but I mean, monsters are a metaphor for immigrants. I don't think. That might be a bit awkward. Um, I'm going to keep the monsters out and keep all the people and immigrants in. People and no, people are immigrant. I'm making this worse. Just ignore me. I'm just gonna build a wall. <laughs> just let me build a wall. That's all I want to do. That's all my purpose of life is right now. Well, that's nearly done. But the wall needs to be the priority right now. I'm moving that. Oh, look. It's got three bits. So there's three bits of the wall. And this is gonna be number two priority. Because we should see that jump up. And hopefully encourage a few more visitors to this to this fine fine village that I've got growing here. Um, but I think he's I think there's a missing one. There we go. See, so come on, it's ninety six. Come on, just tick over. Just tick over right now. Well, what's happening here? What? 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 Okay, I'm going to let them kill them. I think I think these guys still got levels, right? Yeah, they've still got levels, and they've still got... He's only nine years old? Nine years old? He's taking on a slime? Good good for you, mate. Seven, yeah, he's level seven, so I'll let him take, take on that little beast. But there we go. So, yep, there. Oxygen is raised by eight, so that will hopefully encourage eight... So Good old souls to come to our village. Headless. Yes, get, 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 get out of here. Just piss off. Alright, so we've got some trash here. So let's... Essentially, we're, we're being the trash man for a little while. Until things are a little bit more healthier for us. So I'll move that over there. 
And there's some trash here too. So I'll move that there. Cool. Okay, I'm not seeing much progress on this wall. Still not seeing a lot of progress on this wall. Hmm. Oh, there we go. We're seeing something happen here. Richard Anderson. Richard Anderson is going to... Oh, there we go. That's what we want to see. Boom. Cool. As slow as it is, that is coming together. We've got, we've got quite a little bit of stone. Oh, what's this? What's this? What are, you, what are you doing? The walls are being attacked. What? Monsters are about to attack your stone wall and poke a hole through the defenses. No, they're not. Monsters will attack your walls if the main entry to the village is too congested. Nah. You're dreaming. I don't think it's going to happen. I'm refusing to believe that monsters are going to attack that wall. That wall is impenetrable. I'm getting attacked. Though. Someone's getting attacked. I can hear them. Oh, there they are. Okay. Yep. Good. Good guys. The range. The rangers took them on because the rangers. That's their job. Their job is to take that on. They did a good job. We'll let the rangers do what they have to do. But that that is definitely nearly done. But because we've got okay, that is going to be a low priority. I'm tired of people doing that shit. Start working on that. It should not even be a, a, a thought in your brain right now. I've got a key there. So a key unlocks little little chests that you can find around the place. Okay. Ooh. See, this whole episode is just about this damn wall. So strap in, because yeah, ten minutes into it, and we've, all we've done is talked about this wall probably going to be speaking to about it for the next 20. Oh, dog. Wild doggo. Do I have... Yes, I do. So let's... I'm gonna... Yay! The doggo. He's going to join our village. He's going to be uh, an assistant to one of our, our guys. It's going to help. That's... I'm really liking the progress here. There we go. There. Oh, look. Oh, that was nice. Maggie. Welcome, Maggie. Maggie has joined. Hopefully going to help Richard Anderson carry some goods around. That's going to be... So that wall's nearly done. But essentially, we've just got f five more spots on that wall. And that can be the main focus. I'm a bit worried about that. A little bit concerning. I'm gonna have to up. I'm gonna have to up my farming a little bit, which is a little bit frustrating because I don't need that to be the priority right now. All I need is my organizers and my builders to to really build and organize. I know it seems weird to the builders and organ builders and um, organizers will build and organize, but that's what I need them to do right now. Some food there. Mating. Did you ever notice, notice Graham Lovegood has found a new mate, Luna Lovegood? Oh, I really hope they're married. It's going to be really awkward. If uh, if one of them have a home, they may tr try to go home and make a baby. And if they also may visit each other to, to boost their mood or try and live in the same house when possible, that would be very good. So this is here is the total children. This is what you want to help you increase your population too. So that needs to be... You have to look after that. Because we want that to increase. That's the goal. But we also want to have enough room for them too. So kind of have to look after these two little sections up here. Alright, I've still got five slots up here. This wall has not started to build at all. Maybe if I... um, Maybe if I help... I wonder if, what happens if I help. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, well, it's dawn, so let's move two of these rangers. Let's move these two over to being a builder. Let's 
get that build on. Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, the glorious wall. Oh. Oh, you made trash. Let's move this trash over there. So only a little bit left of that, the little section there. And this can be really starting to work on. And then we're going to dismantle that because I don't get rid of that. Get rid of that. What are you worried about? Ooh, who owns an animal? Wink Winkershire? We have a dog called Winkershire in this damn village? Where the hell's Winkershire? There's Maggie. There's Maggie the dog. Where's Winkershire? I'm really curious where Winkershire is. Oh, I hear one of them. Where's the other one? Kind of worried about that. Oh no, there we go. Oh there, Winkershire. We actually do have a dog called Winkershire. That's the weirdest thing in the world. What the hell is a Winkenshire? 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 Whatever, that's a weird name. I'm judging the dog's name. <laughs> D dismantling always has highest priority, by the way. So regardless of what you ever do, dismantling will always go above everything. It's a weird, weird thing. I think maintainers, once you get the maintainer in the building, that takes precedence as well. Um, ooh, there we go. Ooh, we've got this tower up, so... Where do we want this? We probably want that there, right? Yeah, we want that there, so... We'll get rid of... We'll swap this to a square. And we'll get rid of that. That's about right. So we'll want to put it right there, and then match that up. About right, yeah. Actually, no, it's about there. We want that all up. Then we punch that there. So you know, it has to be perfect, otherwise it would cause me to go crazy. And now that we're kind of near the end of building the wall, we kind of want to start setting up our defenses. So we're gonna, oh, we're gonna want that. That's. It's going to be our, our defensive wall. We're going to build it all along here. And it's going to be the glorious defensive wall. It'll be like the wall of Mordor. Not Mordor. Helm's Deep. That's the one I meant. Though it may... The Helm's Deep may have walls may have fell. fell. In the hindsight, that was a really bad metaphor. But still, it's going to be a good wall. That's what I'm trying to say. It's going to be a massive... It's going to be an awesome defended wall. It's going to keep all the alien, all the aliens. It's going to keep all the monsters out. And also, you know how I said um, dismantling anything takes precedent. The same as if you destroy ter uh, terrain like that. That just that just takes precedent, and they just destroy it. So you can destroy terrain to make room. I don't know if I've done that in this this playthrough yet, but. That's what it does. So I'm gonna move this trash around because trash. A bit worried about it, that overwhelming me. So I'll move that there. Now, how much trash? That's filling up a little bit, so I might upgrade that a bit. So I've got a bit of trash here too. So the problem with moving trash, they just freak out when you do anything. That's nearly done. That wall. Oh, it's got enough supplies for that, that portion of the wall. We just need two more. This last bit. So, what we want. So, it's still morning, so we've still got a bit of time. So, we want that there. And then we want the stone wall there. Now you're probably wondering why I didn't put it like up a little bit. It's because the, 
it blocks off there too. So it's just the way it's all structured. Sorry, this is my iPhone freaking out. So just the way um, the squares and stuff work in this game, um, you, it makes sense to put there because it, it will be flush. My tower line will be flush that way if it's like that. If being flush is what matters the most rather than whether it's technically right or wrong. So there we go. So that's going to be a defensive wall. Now that the key to it now, and we're probably going to need some manufacturing of some bows as well. Um, I can't remember where, where is it? Refining? No, it's not a refining. Manufacturing? Bow, there it is. Oh, my Robbie's child died in childbirth. I guess that's, that's, Kind of shitty, really. We really needed children, Margo. Starvation. So, ah, uh, we have. All right, let's let's move this food over here. Cause, cause we've got a bit of food, so I don't know why she's got starvation going on. So move that there. Got a lot of our food, so let's let's move that a little bit closer. And there's a chest there, so so if someone can get that key and bring it to the chest, it'll be unlocked, and then we might get a lot of good resources. Desperately need resources based on how they, things are going here, but um, we'll move this here. Ooh, close the walls, close to finish. The northern walls nearly finished. How are we looking on a resource? Outside of that, it's pretty standard. Right now, we're just building up a defense. I probably messed up of how far away I've made the defenses, though. That may become a problem. But, ooh, we've already got a part of the wall built. Would you look at that? Shove that here. The wall has started to cut, take shape. So, we're going to move this to a second priority. We're going to move this to third priority and this is going to be a number four priority so they're going to make um bows that are got uh sorry um arrows that's going to feed our makeshift bow towers that we're going to have all across there um and also i'm going to get them to make some um just normal bow and arrows for defenses so that's the goal right now that's what we want to work towards so let's hope we get there oh we got a chicken too oh, i forgot um the chicken mod so with the launch of the game they're released you can get animals and stuff um which i don't have yet which is actually going to be a massive source of food for us so let's get another one actually no we'll get rid of that there because this kind of works as a storage house so i think i will shove that there i think it's going to be more benefit to us and let's bring those this crystallization is a little bit closer. Not crystallization, no, like crystal trash. I want to collect all this trash just so when we get a processing unit, um, we can make them to usable um, resources. One more. Oh, that's actually, if that's 50 percent, I think that's got enough resource that we can finish that wall. Finally. Oh, look at it come together. Oh. This, I, I guess this is kind of how Trump feels when it's coming and it's slowly coming together. What are you doing? Oh, so he's going to bring the last brick. And all in all, we're just uh, another brick in the wall. And that's going to complete the wall, finally. Harold Jordan is going to be our savior and finish that. What what are you doing, Harold? Are you seriously you going home? Instead of finishing the wall, he went home. I hope you die, Harold. 
If, Hero, if it comes up Harold died, no one, no one's gonna have sympathy here, all right? <laughs> Harold, you should have finished the damn war. All right, <laughs> let's try again. J J J Janer Heron Ab Abaddon. Can't pronounce that. I butchered that name. A lot of the time when the game was going through early development, I think it wasn't even on Patreon. What the hell's that? I've never seen that spawn like that before. Um, an early Patreon, uh, people that donated got to be actually characters in the game, so that could actually be a real life person, so I do apologize if I butchered that name, but whether you butch butchered it or not, you completed a northern wall. So with that completion, it's going to force all the monsters from this side, or anyone that's going to go that way, it's going to force them all around to this section, which is what we wanted. So, thank you. The northern wall has been completed. And we probably can get rid of that. So let's get rid of that. And now all the focus can be to the southern wall, which is going to be essentially our battleground for a lot of the stuff. Um, let's let's get the makeshift tower done. So we'll help out there. Because it's midday now, and we're running out of time to get things done, so... So we're going to destroy that. Now, this brick in the middle. Yep. Okay. I'm going to speed things up a little bit. Ah, oh, not enough influence, damn it. Cool. We're going to get that tower up. The tower's going to be done soon. If we manage to get a couple of towers up before an evening, I think we're actually going to be in good position. We're going to be in a very good position. So let's move the trash over here. We just need more people. That's the problem right now. We just need more people in this village. Oh, it's nearly done. There we go. We've got our defensive unit. Yep, we need to get ammo. To, uh, the makeshift tower that your villagers have just completed needs ammunition to function. You need to build an ammo manufacturing building, which we have over here, to accompany it like a boa or rock tumbler. Tumbler? Tumbler. Whatever. Either way, that's going to be the next priority. I think probably once we get to evening, we'll probably up that priority and get that done. Um, the second night's not going to be so bad. Look at these little, our little prisoners. Second night's still not going to be that bad, but it would be good to have some kind of unit to to start defending for us. Now let's move that over here. Actually, let's move all this wood stuff over here so that it can be used. I love the soundtrack though, it's very soothing, especially when you're waiting a lot. A small, a small village of 12 has actually done very well. I wish you could name your village. I wonder if you could. I don't think you can. Hey, let's look at population. We've got Virginia Potts, Nancy Griffin, Graham Lovegood, D that dude I probably can't pronounce, Mitsubishi Colt, George Robbie, Oop. Richard Anderson, Maga Robbie, uh, Harold Jordan, Wybon Mamel, Luna Lovegood, Bernard Palsy, Winkenshire again, and Maggie. Okay. I like it. It's a nice little, little starting village. They won't build a damn wall. I don't realize how important this wall is. We will die without this wall. They seem to be, they seem to be getting the message slowly. Let's move this out of the way. Let's move this over here. Yeah, look at it come. It's slowly coming together, though. It's pretty cool. A little wall. We just need more stone. Hmm. There we go. 
they're getting the message. The the slowly building it. And actually, hmm. Now I've noticed I got one back here because I destroyed that little thing here. So the question is, do I build a cluck hoop or defense? It feels like this is the smarter option. Another defensive units, a different defensive tower. I think that's going to be the priority. I think our defense is going to be, start to be more and more important. Ah, oh, there we go. I think, can I just pick up this key and put it on there? There we go. There we go. That's a lot of stuff that I don't need. I think, is that raw meat? Raw hide. Yeah. Feathers. None of that's going to help me right now. That's disappointing. That's very disappointing. Well, we'll move that over here. Well, that's when we'll leave it. So thank you all for joining me on this riveting filled adventure of building walls and watching walls be built. Um, next time, we probably will hit evening. So we're going to actually see how we're going to be set up for our defense. So thank you all for watching for this part four of Rise to Ruins. If you do want the game, make sure you look at the link below. It's a really good indie game. I do encourage it. So really get into it. Um, and until next time, hopefully if you want the next one, if you want the next one, make sure you like the video and do all that fun stuff. But yeah, until next time.